Yes, sir. Welcome back. Welcome back. You will all recognize my next guest as the judge of Food Network's Chopped and host of Cooks vs. Cons. He is a chef and restaurateur who recently opened his new venture, Point Royal, at the Diplomat Beach Resort in Florida. Please welcome the great Jeffrey Zakarian. Hey, man. Wow, you're good, man. Thank you. Are. Good. How are you? I'm, I'm I haven't great. seen you. I saw you at Christmas time, right? Remember I that? saw you at Christmas time, and then I went to your restaurant, the National, uh, in Greenwich. Incredible. Thank you very what much. A, what a great talent Thank you are. You. We're honored to have you here. Thanks for having me. Before we go on, what was yeah. your prom like? Oh, God. You, I knew you were going to ask me. <laughs> I have a confession. I did not go because the one I loved belonged to somebody else, and that's a song. It's tough. It's tough, and I have three kids now, so I'm trying to, like, I'm trying to get them ready for, like, forget perfection. You just need progress, right? <laughs> right. So, what are we making today? Okay, so you like ribs, right? Everybody oh, loves ribs. gosh. Okay, so these are, these are short ribs, which means it's just a short rib, thick and short, with the bone, and we're going to uh, glaze it with a pomegranate, great pomegranate cilantro garlic star in these glazes. Do, do I have the best guest ever? Yeah. Well, I just do. So you're going to help me. Okay, okay. I'd love to. I so, need to know how to do this. Okay, so th we have seared these, these beautiful uh, pieces of short rib in this pan, and we've left some of the fat. And okay. this is the beauty, this is the beauty of, of cooking is right there. That's what you need. I mean, fat, everybody says fat is bad. A lot of fat is bad, but it has flavor. That's the flavor. That's the flavor, right? And you know, this is almost like the Trinity here we got. We got That's right. Trinity. So you want to help me add this? Sure. To this, we're just going to add some carrots. Okay. Some onions. Some celery. Okay. Do you like to cook? I love to cook. Yeah, I can tell. I love it. I, like to, I can tell you likes to cook because the way he talks about food. Oh, yeah. You no. can always tell someone who likes food by the way he talks about it. That's all it. All right, so we're going to add some coriander. You can just put that all in. Okay. Some, that's one of those things that I have in my spice rack. I don't know what it does. It's great. I just put it in to make people think, I'm adding some coriander now. Don't worry about well, it. Well, it's like, you know, it's, you know, cilantro, this is the C. So the cilantro. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Okay. Some bay leaf. Okay. This is another thing. This doesn't do anything. This just makes you look fancy. Oh, no, no. It's great flavor. Star anise. Star anise. Yes, ginger. I, I've never held one of these. It's a great name, star anise, right? Oh. Sounds is like that a real thing or did you just a real it on thing. the floor? No, it's a real thing. <laughs> okay. That's not a cockroach. No. <laughs> <laughs> it's not big enough. It's not big enough. That's big enough That's to be big a cockroach. That's, exactly. That's, That's a New York one. That's a New York one. Okay. And what are these? Uh, thyme. Thyme. Some ginger. Ginger. All okay. of that? All of that. Woo. Okay, That's so we're going to stir that around. Okay. You want to get this nice and caramelized, right? Just get some love, get it good and soften, right? And just in the fat of the ribs. This is all this is. Okay. But can you smell that? That smells smell that? so good. So just this, you just put it in there now. Well, what's now, interesting is, is it's just got a few ingredients that I never would have thought of, and it smells so much more complex than anything I make. So it's, well, I'm excited to do learn this it. at home. Okay, yeah. so once it gets softened, I want you to add, uh, first of all, we're going to add the ribs back in. Now okay. we're going to nestle them in here. So you would wait until that... Nice and soft. Okay. Yeah. We're going to nestle them in, all right? Yeah, you know they're good if they're nestled. They're nestled. <laughs> all right? I never nestle my ribs. Now, Everybody, I, you know what this is? This is a Dutch oven, right? Everybody yes. have, if you don't have one of these, get one. They're a little bit more expensive. It's cast worth iron. worth it, though. It's worth it. You have it forever. You pass this down to your kids. Yeah. Okay, so you're going to put some orange juice, okay. red wine, this and is, chicken stock. Okay, this is chicken stock. Orange juice, red wine. Red wine. It it's just, doesn't seem so easy. It, this I'm going to do this tonight. <laughs> okay, so now you, you cover this. Okay. And put it in the oven at 275 degrees. 275, low, okay. for about four or five hours until it completely... Just fall, oh. falls off the ribs. And what do you get? You get a beautiful looking plate that I'm going to finish here. This is the sauce. Now, the sauce here is all of this liquid after four hours strained. And we add the magic pomegranate juice. Ooh. Okay. And pomegranate juice, every nose is very good for you. It's sure. a natural, you know. It's antioxidants. A, it's, oh, it's the number one antioxidant. You know, it's like the big rage. Because I got around, a lot of oxidants. You got a lot of oxidants. <laughs> well, I know what an up, oxidant you is. You grew up in a place that has a lot of, you know, New Orleans is a place with yeah. a lot of oxidants. Yeah. Don't you think? Yeah, it has a lot of oxidants. Okay, so. It's, it's no accident that you use it in your food. <laughs> so we reduced it all the way. We're going to get this beautiful glaze, and then we talked oh. a little carrot salad, and you're going to take a bite of this. Are you oh, ready? Oh, boy. All right. So this is the glaze. Come on, then. Go look right in there. Look at that. And just... I topped it with something that looks so healthy, right? Because... Yeah. Look, oh, now, look you can have rice with kidding? it, but I'm telling you. Look, y'all. Look at that. Look at those yeah. ribs. Look at that. Holy oh, moly. Little this... sauce. Make sure it's mm. a little sauce. It's incredible. It's so good. Jeffrey, you're the man. Thank you very much. Thanks for having man. me on. Un it's Thank you. It's soft, right? It's delicious. All right, and it's got a lot of stuff going on. Do not forget to, uh, to, to catch Cooks vs. Cons on Food Network Wednesdays, 9, 8 Central, for the full recipe. And I'm going to have to remind myself, too. Go to <laughs> harrytv.com. We'll be right back. Thank you.